Okay, so I like to make a volcano. Now we're starting here with, with this uh, shape that doesn't really look much like a volcano, so let's just clear that. I need to pick a color that looks a little bit like a volcano outside. So I'm going to pick some brown. I'm take, using the pen. I could use the circle tool to make a perfectly round shape, but, but most volcanoes are not completely perfectly round, so I'm just going to take the pen and, and draw some kind of irregular, but, but somewhat round shape. Perhaps like this. And I'm going to fill it up. So that's a good start. We're basically looking at the volcano from the top. So we, we can look here doesn't look much like a volcano yet so certainly I need to add some kind of inflation some inflating our volcano starts to look a little bit like a mountain but the surface looks much too smooth so that is no good so let me add some noise here and that is starting to look better so this could be a bit of a volcano of course, in a volcano wouldn't be a volcano if it actually didn't have a crater with, with some magma inside. So I'm going to pick a color again, red. And once again, I'm going to draw some somewhat irregular shape. So here's my magma in inside the volcano. Or maybe you know it's again not very symmetrical necessarily. going to fill it up. That looks interesting but certainly not quite what we're having in mind here so at the very least I need to select now just very specifically the magma with the magic wand. I'm going to remove the noise so it's smooth but that's still not the effect that we had in mind. So what, what I want to have is this to be much lower so I'm going to bring down the ceiling to squish down the magma, perhaps like this. So now it's starting to look a little volcano-ish. And of course I can keep drawing my shape. So for instance here wh what I want to do is to go ahead and pick the, the red color to make it leak out somewhat. And that's our volcano.